it's Trevor Forever 595 and today I'm just going to show you a quick tutorial on basic gist on how to use Cheat Engine. Because a lot of people have been asking like how do you figure out all this stuff. Well mainly if I can't figure it out by the way that I'm just going to, what I'm about to show you is I usually look on YouTube. But this is the basic gist on how to do it. So you, I'm in Firefox Armor Games. So, as always, every time you use Cheat Engine, you always want to select the process you want to use. So, you usually should use the browser. I'm always using Firefox, so if you want to get similar results, I recommend using the same browser, but it should work in other browsers. So, And so, once you do that, you get all this first scan, next scan, undo scan, and the scan type. Usually you don't want to mess with the scan type unless you're hacking something a little bit more complex than what usually what I usually do. But value type is what you usually want to fiddle around with if you can, if it doesn't work. You can ones I usually use is two, four, two, four, and eight bytes, and then double. On two bytes, you can do just do two bytes. First of all, the way cheat engine sort of works, you can multiply the amount. Of a, val a value, whatever you want, by 1, 8, 16, or 24. So, say if you have like 10 gold on the game, you just multiply that by 10. Or, no, sorry, 1, and you get like 10 gold. And then, oops, remember, cheat engine, you can just like type in like 10, hit first scan, and then change the value so it can get a closer estimate of what you're trying to like locate. And if that doesn't work, you just move up to 8, and then 16, then 24, and if those don't work, move up to 4 bytes, repeat that process, and then go up to 8, and so forth. And then, if that doesn't work, just do double. You can try tr truncated or whatever, but that usually barely ever works, so I always use, I always try rounded default, and then do the 1 or 8, 16 or 24, but yeah, that's pretty much the basic basic scanning techniques I use to find a value to change and you also can select the process directly so if you like have let's say sunny 2 open you can bring over cheat engine hit process and then scroll through here until you see oops, load sunny 2 so you can see so I'm in Firefox, right? And so I can click process. Just scrub through here real quick. And until you see it. But if you don't see it, close out Cheat Engine and go back. But you should see it. So close out Cheat Engine real quick. Open up Cheat Engine again. Okay, and then click the little computer, go to window list, see up here, Cheat Engine, scrub through here until you see something. Like, Let's see, see, there's my YouTube, Hypercam, Camtasia, and here you should see Sunny 2, Sunny 2 on Armor Games, Mozilla, Firefox, you can click open that, and you can, if using Firefox your browser doesn't work, you can, you, you can, go to the actual game directly like this and retry it. This sometimes makes it work a little bit better because you're just scanning that game, not the whole browser. So, yeah. So that's a basic gist on how to use Cheat Engine. If you have any comments or anything to add, please leave a comment and I'll try and add an annotation saying some more information on 
how to use Shinya Engine, but that's the basic gist on how to scan for a value. But this doesn't always work, so please don't complain on anybody's Shinya Engine video saying it doesn't work, it doesn't work, because it might not always work, or they've changed the coding in the game, or a game's just coded differently, but yeah, please don't leave those hateful comments, because those sometimes really get annoying. So, thank you. I guess that's pretty much it. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.